What products do I use for an attic ventilation system? You'll need both intake and exhaust. A balanced attic ventilation system, or intake and exhaust vents, is important to help reduce attic temperatures and excess moisture in your attic. Here's how it works. Intake vents at or near the bottom of the roof allow outside air into the attic. This fresh air continually flows through the attic and back outside through exhaust vents at or near the top of the roof. This can help protect the roof system from the inside out in virtually all climates and weather conditions. So what products do you need for an attic ventilation system? Let's start with intake, considered the most important part of an attic ventilation system. If no air is coming in, no air can flow out. There are two common types of intake vents, soffit vents and rooftop intake vents. Soffit vents are the most common since many homes are constructed with roof overhangs or eaves. The soffit is typically at the lowest point of the roof, making it an ideal location for fresh air to enter the attic. Soffit vents come in various styles, such as individual vents, continuous strips, or ventilated soffit panels. When a home has limited or no soffits, rooftop intake vents are a great option. These vents help eliminate the need for expensive, time-consuming work to build new or alter existing soffits. Now, let's look at our options for the other half of a balanced attic ventilation system, exhaust vents. Exhaust ventilation works best when it's installed at or near the highest point of the roof to move as much hot, humid air out of the attic as possible. There are three common categories of exhaust vents, including static, powered, and mechanical. Static exhaust vents use the natural flow of air as hot air rises. There is no electricity required to power the vent. There are three types of static exhaust vents, ridge, hip, and roof louvers. Ridge vents are the most common type of exhaust vent product installed on homes today because it is effective and generally easy to install. Ridge vents are installed at the highest point of the roof, called the ridge or peak, making it an ideal location to let hot air escape the attic. Also, ridge vents blend with the finished roof as they are often low profile and covered by ridge cap shingles. Hip vents are very similar to ridge vents in function and appearance. They are useful in helping ventilate homes that have hip roof designs with very limited or no ridge area. For uniform appearance, they're installed on the entire hip, but only the top portion of the hip is actually ventilated. Depending on the design of the roof, they can also be combined with the ridge vents to provide the total amount of exhaust needed. Sometimes referred to as box vents, roof louvers are another popular exhaust vent option for modern roof designs, hip roofs, smaller roof areas, and those with limited or no ridge line. Their small size will typically require multiple vents to be installed to achieve the needed amount of exhaust ventilation. But roof louvers can be installed strategically on the back portion of the roof for the best aesthetic appearance. They can be installed on existing or new roofs. A powered exhaust vent helps remove a large volume of warm, humid air out of an attic space. They can be powered by electric, solar, or a hybrid of both. Powered exhaust generally comes in two types, roof and gable mount. Roof-mounted exhaust installs over openings in the roof deck. Gable-mounted vents are easy to install from inside the attic and help to avoid roof penetrations. Powered exhaust vents typically have different CFM, cubic feet per minute, airflow ratings. The higher the CFM airflow of the vent, the faster the vent will exhaust the air from the attic. Mechanical exhaust, such as wind turbines, use the power of the wind. Similar to a static vent, it uses the natural flow of air in the attic and requires adequate amounts of intake ventilation. However, when there is wind present, the turbine spins and helps pull heat and moisture from the attic space. The turbine sits higher above the roof surface and may be a bit less aesthetically pleasing than other exhaust options, but they move air effectively when wind is present to spin the turbine. When there's no wind, they function similarly to a static exhaust vent. Which type of vents are best for my roof? There is no single answer. Every home is different. The best vents for your roof will vary depending on your home's architectural style, the design of your roof, and even your regional climate. That being said, it's very important to avoid mixing different types of exhaust vents within the same attic space, which can disrupt the proper airflow of intake and exhaust. A qualified roofing professional should be able to plan a balanced attic ventilation system of intake and exhaust vents that will help reduce excess heat and moisture from your attic. To help calculate your attic's ventilation needs, visit gaf.com slash vent calculator. GAF